Welcome to this week's episode of Now Loading. I am BioMonkey. I'm Big Ant, the foul mouth gamer. And I'm Death Vanquished. Oh my god, are you kidding me? What? Seriously, can we not go through a single intro without somebody dying or missing or singing music? You know, I think most of that is Death's fault. Dude, your death, remember? No, dude, Bio looks really pissed. We should probably do it right. Welcome to this week's episode of Now Loading. I'm Bio Monkey. God damn it! Please tell me you have some good news for the ESA. Um, Microsoft is going to show off a lot of details for the next Xbox. Good, 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 good. What about Nintendo? Well, um, they are going to have a smaller presence. Smaller presence? Is that even possible? Apparently it is. Uh, did we at least get the big three? Mm, who are the big three? You should know this. Activision, EA, and 2K? Since when were they the big three, sir? Since, like, forever. What about Ubisoft? Come on, we all know Ubisoft is a retarded stepbrother of the video game industry. Ooh, really? They are just French. And Canadian. Mm, and French-Canadian. <sighs> but, to answer your question, EA and Activision have already purchased their venues for E3. And what about 2K? They did not answer to our save the date. New console generation, this may be the smallest E3 since E for All. Oh god, I forgot that was a thing. I wish I could forget. What are you doing? Coming up with a parody for the Ballad of the Crystal Empire. Ballad? Why do we have to keep telling you that you can't sing? Oh, you don't have to tell me that anymore. I'm just a lyricist now. You have too much time on your hands. Alright, this is what I have so far. Randy Pitchford needs our help. His magic will not last forever. Yes, Gearbox can do it, but they need to work together. They have to get this right. Yes, we have to make them see. They can save the homeworld IP with its history. Dude, what are you singing? Oh, just make it a parody of the song about saving the crystal ponies. Jesus, dude, I cannot believe I'm friends with a brony. I gotta agree. What are you talking about? I'm not a brony. Wait, what? Could've fooled me. Dude, you can't be serious. Look, I'm not a brony because I refuse to self-identify as one. Oh, okay. So, just because you say you're not something makes it true. Right. You are a growing ass man. Uh, yeah. You watch a kid's show about ponies. Yep. You are a brony. Logic checks out. Oh, come on. I can watch the show and not be a brony. Do you own anything from the show? Not any official merchandise other than the trading cards Bio gave me. Dude, Bio. They were given to me when I was picking up some supplies for Vanguard. Dude, stop enabling him. Okay, look, I've seen your Twitter. I know you own at least two t-shirts, one with a fucking pony on it. How are you not a brony? Because I don't identify as one. Hell, I would never go to a con. Really? That's what it takes to make a brony, a person who's willing to go to a con. Well, no, I'm just saying. What about the bronies that don't have the money or can't make it to a convention? No, no, what I meant to say is that- Also, I mean, if a clan member can't make it to a cross burning, is he suddenly no longer a racist? Wait, did you just compare bronies to the Ku Klux Klan? No, it's just an analogy. And a good one at that. Damn Skippy. Oh god. I, I am a brony. Hey -o. Hey Randy. Hey, hey, calm down. Remember what we said about running in the halls of Gearbox? I remember. Good. 
Now, what was so important that you had to break one of our only office rules? You, so, you know when you go on eBay and you see something weird, but you think it would be funny to bid on it? No. Well, you know, you know you're know, you surfing your movie memorabilia, and you see the pie from American Pie promos, and say you maybe bid like 38 bucks on it. Because what the hell? You know, it's funny, and you kind of assume somebody somewhere will probably outbid you on it. Okay... And then say maybe three weeks pass and you receive a package with maybe a product in it that you never really meant to buy in the first place. Then why would you bid on it? You know, just as a laugh, you know, ha ha, funny. It doesn't seem that funny. Especially when it comes to my latest impulse auction bid. I assume this is why you had to come running. I bid on the Home World franchise. Jesus Christ, that's a bit more than a fake pie with a hole in it. Yeah, and I won the bid. What? Did nobody else bid? Yeah, there, there were other bidders, but uh, apparently I outbid them. Kind of what happens in an auction. Well, I guess Gearbox can make a homeworld game. Yeah, because, you know, we're doing so much with the Duke Nukem franchise. Don't. Tell death, but I watched the first episode of My Little Pony. What? I said, don't tell death. It, you know, I would have preferred not knowing. Ugh. I can't believe I'm asking you this, but what did you think? Honestly, it kind of moved too fast. I didn't like any other characters other than Fluttershy. Her part was cute. My god. Too bad it is about ponies. I probably would watch the whole show if it were starring humans. Wow, really? You'd probably be interested in Equestrian Girls. How long have you been standing there? Since you said Fluttershy was cute? Hey, you don't know cute till you hear the squee. I hate you both. Yeah, well, I watched one episode and that's all I needed. That's cool, so you watched the entire two-parter. You know, that's more of a chance than Ant would ever give it. Two-parter? You did watch both parts, right? Nope. Oh, so Nightmare Moon shows up, wrecks some shit, and you just walk away. Well, I can't get over the fact that they're ponies. What is that, some nouveau bro code? You got a problem with ponies? Let's just say they take me to a place I don't want to go. Where do they take you? To a place you don't want to see me go. Walk. Let me get this straight. You never like ponies? Never. What if your best friend liked ponies? You'd never pick up the show? No ponies. Santa Claus would watch My Little Pony with his best friend. Do I look like Santa Claus? Do I look like Santa Claus to you? What is it? Ponies make you um poco loco? Bang bang crazy? I watch My Little Pony, bad things happen. I don't like that. What kind of things? Very bad things, Death. Walk. What about dragons? Move! Wait, was that from the rundown? I think so. Santa Claus doesn't give any breaks! <laughs> Ponies, there's great, must have 